A panel was held last week to go over the Summer Wells case. As of the recording of this video, 5,548 people have seen it. On the panel were five creators, three who've covered Summer extensively, two haven't. Let's listen. Been here? Yes. Yeah, been there. She was today. Oh my God. I don't even know how any, like, let's say that regardless if these two are guilty or they're innocent, either way, I don't know how the hell they can just be there and it not have any impact. It has an impact. Do you think they should leave Ben Hill? Wouldn't the question then become, what if Summer came back and her parents had moved away? Look at Chris and Katie. All they did was go to Horn Lake and look what happened there. At all. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, they got rid of everything. her shit, Brittany, right away. They were selling oh, yes. her toys right away. They yeah. were getting rid of her clothes. They were getting rid of the Paw Patrol dresser. Did Summer have a Paw Patrol dresser? If so, where were the photos? How do we even know that? Where are the for sale posts of this dresser? I mean, they got rid of Summer so fast. I've got the yard so sale fast. stuff. I've got the yep. yard sale posts. That's yeah. right. The yard sale. Yep. And didn't we catch them on eBay selling toys? Justin mentions the yard sale, Cher confirms, and says Benny caught them selling summer stuff on eBay, but Justin doesn't seem to know about that. I don't or remember Or was that just eBay? Benny that found that? I don't remember eBay. So. I remember, wasn't it Robin and Candace were washing the toys together to donate to a, to a church to or something? Donate they to donate to churches. They did donate to some, and Candace sold some. Robin is on tape talking about washing summer's church toys today i can't help but be a little sad that summer is not here today to help here she was just last year dressed as a cute little shepherd we are hoping and praying that she would be found before christmas and here is christmas day still no summer but we are not giving up prayers are still being lifted that she will be found safe Thank you everyone who helped clean her toys. Most of them were Paw Patrol toys. The kids loved cleaning them too. Some were pretty dusty and dirty as Paw Patrol toys should be. <laughs> From all their search and rescue missions, I'm sure Summer played out every episode she ever saw. Special attention was given to this little toy who is the character Ryder. He is the young boy who leads the team. His right eye was partially covered in dirt. While cleaning Ryder's eyes, I prayed that the search teams would have their eyes open to where Summer is. It's been 193 days. Let the little girl who loved to play search and rescue missions be found safe and brought back home. One marketplace. Yep, how long? Guys. How long after the disappearance was Not that? Long. Uh, within two weeks. Yeah. Are you serious? Dead yeah. serious. This We're is proven. Lying. They did This that. is proven. Sure. It's literally on. Yes, it's public. Uh, we've all got that covered. Look at Justin's. I think it was about two I don't weeks remember after. how long it was, but it was. I don't very remember. Soon. But it was. It wasn't very long. It, it was shocking to me. Okay. You know, that, well, there's already a lot of stuff missing by the time Chris McDonough went, which was, what, two or three weeks after the... These are them girls that she likes. Them new fashion, I don't know what they are, little princesses or whatever. She's like all kinds of, here's one of them bracelets. Oh, that's just uh, one of them, can't, what do they call these? Oh, this is a little pony bracelet. Yeah, I don't know what yeah. they were really called, 
but she liked them, and so I just every time I go to the garage sale, I'd buy her what she wanted. After uh, she was reported, was July, mid July, three weeks it. to a month, something like that. Okay, yeah. so sometime uh, uh, around then they were already selling off and getting rid of toys. <laughs> TBI? TBI? Where are you at? Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. Oh, it. girl. Not if right you want to know where TBI is at, you got to watch some other videos and go down a rabbit hole because TBI? Ooh. I see that it was in November that she sold Summer's fourth birthday Paw Patrol toys in November. How the hell could you part with things like that? You wouldn't That's be so to. Oh my god, I'm just going to mute right now. Most <laughs> parents keep the room like the same. Yep. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like they, But in their case, they actually clean the room um, yep. after the child is no longer, you know, after the children are no longer there. Mm -hmm. So they doc, doc, it was so bad Dr. Phil made them like paint the room and shit before he would show it. He wouldn't even show it the way no, it really, really No. Was. No, Justin, no. I was choked up over seeing Candace getting rid of all of Summer's toys, all of her Paw Patrol toys. That hurt me. That hurt me so bad. It hurt me deep inside because that right there, that act alone, just that, tells me that Candace knows that Summer is never coming back. She knows that there's not a chance of Summer coming back or else she wouldn't have given away all of her toys, which were filthy, by the way. It's a shame that Summer's only toys she had was filthy. Okay, so now we've listened to the claims. I went back in time, grabbed some of these photos, I think this is the November photo that people are talking about, which is November 22nd, 2020. Garage sale going on at Beach Creek today. Come by and check out a little bit of everything. Let's look at what's being sold in these photos. Here are some of the items. I don't even know what these are, but these are some of the items that were for sale, some scrubs and other things. Let's look at the Paw Patrol. Could this be the dresser that Cher was talking about? No, it's a book toy holder, but was it a birthday present? Also, no. Yes, this picture was posted on Summer's birthday, but it's showing specifically the toys she got that are on the floor for her birthday. Was this a gift that she was opening or are there already toys and other things inside there? Is it already dirty? Is it full on the bottom? Yes. This was also posted on Summer's birthday and you can see her opening a present with grandma that is also shown in the photos. We never do see her opening this bookcase toy shelf holder, but we do see her opening this. So here are some comments on the November post. You should wash yourself and your kids in this. Carly also says, it's been a week. You already know the outcome likely isn't going to be good. The girl has an aunt who's been missing a few years from Ohio now. Summer, is that not a red flag? The dad's faces, the dad faces charges in Utah, but ran here instead of facing the consequences. Hmm. March 6, 2021. 
clearance deal, only $14.99, wholesale lot box. Are you selling summer stuff? Julie says this is not summer stuff. So here she says that this little boat is summer stuff in the backpack. Somebody else wants to know if she's in need of some crack. Candace has been going to flea markets and garage sales since as far back as I could see, 2019, maybe even before that, picking up little things and reselling them. This is not something new. Since this rumor first surfaced, just by a quick count, over 20,000 people, plus the people on Facebook, have heard this claim that Candace took Summer's toys, toys she got for her birthday, and sold them either prior to Summer going missing because she anticipated Summer going missing because it was a big plan within two weeks after Summer going missing because they didn't care about summer or later in November for whatever reason. So, you know, tens of thousands of people have heard this rumor. I want to show you some things that are in Candace's home right now as we speak. As you're watching this video, these things are summers and they've been there the entire time or they're things that Candace has actually bought after summer has gone missing in anticipation for summer coming home. Some of these things were sent to me uh, by Candace, some by other people, some I observed myself. Because Candace kept these things, does that make her a perfect mother? No. Does it mean she's innocent of any and everything? No. But she does have these things. She has kept them. So that says something to continue to try to make these people out to be worse than they are and give other creators this information that is blatantly false. Or you're just misinformed and you haven't taken the time to go check is bothersome. There have been more than enough rumors in Summer's case. Why keep adding on to them in 2024? You know, this whole case was nothing but rumors from the start. It doesn't have to be like this. I mean, this <laughs> cards that have been sent to Summer have been put in a scrapbook. A mother who doesn't care isn't going to keep cards that random people from social media send in a scrapbook. I mean, that's just my opinion. You can have your own opinion. This isn't to throw hate at any creator. It's to try to show people, maybe, I'll never reach the, you know, 20 some odd thousand people have already seen these crazy videos, but maybe some people will see it and you can spread that around, that this stuff simply isn't true. 